hello everyone how to simplify this nice algebraic expression so if we have 4 to the power of 10 minus 2 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 uh, we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form uh, so here uh, we solve this problem uh, for two methods uh, and i hope so you like both of these methods uh, so please uh, write into the comment section which method you really like and if you have any other method in your mind please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section uh, so here uh, the very first thing we are going to do is first uh, we need to break this fraction and we write uh, these two terms separately to the denominator of 4 to the power of 5 it will be written as 4 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 minus here we have 2 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 and now here in the next step uh, here we can apply uh, this exponent law if you have a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n uh, it is equals to a to the power of m minus n so we apply uh, this exponent law when our base of these two denominator terms are same then we move our uh, exponent from denominator and we subtract it with the exponent in the numerator term okay uh, so here we apply this exponent law in the first term we move this 5 to the upside it will be written as 4 to the power of 10 minus 5 and here uh, we first uh, simplify this 4 to the power of 5 for this case and we have this is 2 to the power of 10 divided by here we focus in the uh, base term so that here our base is 4 and we write 4 as 2 square and its whole power is 5. And now here in the next step we uh, need to uh, use another exponent law here we know that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so we apply here this exponent law in the denominator term uh, so uh, after applying this law we write this equation this expression as here in the first term we have 4 to the power of 10 minus 5 equals to 5 minus this is 2 to the power of 10 divided by when you multiply these two exponents we obtain here 2 5s are 10 so we again get here 2 to the power of 10 so uh, now here in the next step you see here this 2 to the power of 10 is cancelled out by this 2 to the power of 10 and we get the remaining values are 4 to the power of 5 minus here we get one only so uh, here we have two methods to solve uh, this step uh, so here first we need to multiply this 4 with 5 times uh, so first we find the value of uh, this term so 4 to the power of 5 means that we need to multiply uh, 4 with 5 times in this uh, way uh, so here you see that uh, 4 4s are 16 16 4s are 64 and here when you multiply these two pairs 4 4s are 16 so here in order to uh, find this multiplication we write it as 64 multiplied by 16 uh, and we break the 16 as in this form 10 plus uh, 6 uh, so here we multiply 64 with 10 so 64 multiplied by 10 equals to 640 so 64 multiplied by 6 here so we need to multiply these two terms so we obtain 640 plus this is 6 4s are 24 we write 4 and carry 2 6 6 are 36 36 plus 2 uh, becomes here 38 so further in the next step we need to sum up these two values and we obtain 0 plus 4 equals to 4 and 4 plus 8 becomes 12 we write 2 and carry 1 6 plus 3 is 9 9 plus 1 becomes 10 this means that 4 to the power of 5 equals to uh, 1024 and now here uh, we replace this value 4 to the power of 5 10,000 1024 here 
so when we uh, put this value here it will become 4 to the power of 5 equals to 1024 and minus 1 so it is equals to 1023 so this is the our final answer uh, which we get here from first method and now here uh, we move uh, forward uh, to again solve this problem for second method so in second method uh, here first we need to copy down the given question statement here so the given question statement is 4 to the power of 10 minus 2 to the power of 10 divided by 4 to the power of 5 so here in the second method we first need to focus on this term here you have the base of this term is 4 we write it as 2 times of 2 becomes 4 and its exponent is 10 minus this is 2 to the power of 10 and it is divided by this is 4 to the power of 5 and we write this 4 as 2 square and its whole exponent is 5. And now here after this step we need to apply here two exponent laws in the numerator we apply this exponent law if you have a multiplied by b to the power of m uh, it will be written as a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of m and the parallel we apply here this case if you have a to the power of m to the power of n we write it as a to the power of m multiplied by n so here first we can apply in the numerator uh, we uh, just uh, apply this exponent separately on both of these terms it will be written as 2 to the power of 10 multiplied by 2 to the power of 10 minus this is 2 to the power of 10 divided by here when you multiply these two exponents it is equals to 2 to the power of 2 5s are 10 so we again obtain here 10 and now you see that in the numerator we have 2 to the power of 10 be the common term so that we will take common 2 to the power of 10 and we get the remaining values are 2 to the power of 10 minus 1 divided by 2 to the power of 10. So you see here this 2 to the power of 10 is cancelled out by this 2 to the power of 10 and we get the remaining values are 2 to the power of 10 minus 1. Uh, and here uh, 2 to the power of 10 means that uh, we will just multiply this 2 with 10 times it will be written as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied 2 multiplied 2 this is 5 times and we have this is 2 multiplied 2 multiplied 2 multiplied 2 multiplied 2 so here we have this is 2 is 10 times so when you multiply 2 with 5 times you get 32 and when you multiply this 2 with 5 times you again get 32 so here we break this 32 as we write 32 multiplied by 30 plus 2 and we multiply 32 with both of these values it will be written as 32 multiplied by 30 plus 32 multiplied by 2. So here we get the value of 2 to the power of 10. So we consider this is one digit number this is two digit numbers when you multiply 0 with this number you get 0 when you multiply 3 with this number you get 3 2 is a 6 3 3 is a 9 and here you have this is 2 2 is a 4 and 2 3 is a 6 so we obtain 0 plus 4 is 4 6 plus 6 is 12 we write 2 and carry 1 9 plus 1 becomes here 10 so we obtain here 2 to the power of 10 equals to 1024 because here calculator is not allowed that's why we do all of these uh, calculations here now uh, this expression is written as uh, we have 2 to the power of 10 minus 1 the value of 2 to the power of 10 is 1024 minus 1 uh, 1024 minus 1 equals to 1023 so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos